the quarter. I think there's no doubt about their families back home. Their mothers, wives, sisters, and daughters with a pipe in his hand, said a handsome young lady. The song he was singing so gaily. His name was Pat Murphy of the Mathers Brigade, and he sang of the land of Shillelagh. Anybody awoke on the rebels to have satisfaction. The drummers were beating the devil's tattoo, and calling the troops into action. And the Irish brigade in the battle was seen, their blood for the cause shedding freely. With their bayonets ready, they charged on the foe with a shout for the land of Shillelagh.